And well, this is a crime alert to pass along, and it's just going to have you shaking your head. A couple's catalytic converter stolen from their pickup truck in a church parking lot. They're among the latest victims in a crime that's happening across the Houston area and nationwide. Just yesterday, we brought you this breaking news. As many as 400 catalytic converters seized by police up in northeast Houston. Tonight, new data obtained by KPRC2 reveals a skyrocketing number of these crimes in the city of Houston. Our Roseanne Aragon is live in northwest Harris County now with a story that you'll see only on 2. Roseanne? The worst part is it happened at the Prince of Peace Catholic Church, and it just took a matter of minutes. Thieves looking for a quick buck for what's under the truck. Like always, Stephanie Pinon and her husband went to church Sunday and wanted to help with a blood drive there. My husband stayed after and gave blood, um, and then when he went back to the truck, he turned it on and the sound. Their Toyota Tundra became another target. So we got out, looked underneath, and sure enough, their catalytic converter had been stolen in their church parking lot. And honestly, of all places, you know, that was, I can't believe in, in Everybody's flabbergasted as I tell them the story. She's not alone. In fact, catalytic converter theft calls are up this year more than ever. Houston police releasing these telling numbers. In 2018, there were just 85 calls for catalytic converter thefts. In 2019, 375. Last year, there were 1,793 calls. But get this, this year in 2021 through June, Houston police say there have been more than 2,000 thousand two hundred and seven calls for catalytic converter thefts. They take it in 60 seconds or less. The cost with insurance, she says she'll have to pay a thousand dollars out of pocket for repairs. The job itself for her cost four thousand dollars and then the headache of rental cars. They had a waiting list. It could be days to weeks to get her car back. Her next preventative steps. Put the flat shield over it put your VIN number on, um, and just keep an eye out for other people. And she says she's considering painting her catalytic converter once her truck is repaired. One of many ways police say you can try and help prevent catalytic converter thefts. For more information on what you can do, you can head to our website, click to Houston.com. For now, reporting live from Northwest Harris County, Roseanne Aragon, KPRC 2 News.